Hello and welcome to History Pod. On the 20th of April 1965, workers began painting skylight windows at the Houston Astrodome to limit glare from the sun. The Astrodome was a covered stadium that was the first of its kind. It was built in order to avoid the need to cancel sports fixtures as a result of the hot, humid and therefore often rainy Texas summers. It was given its Astro name to reflect the fact that Houston was home to the control centre of the US space programme. The stadium had cost nearly $32 million to build, and the painting of the skylights added another $20,000 to the cost. The paint job had been made necessary due to glare from the windows affecting the vision of baseball outfielders. Painting the windows significantly improved the situation for the players, but in turn led to other problems inside the stadium. Primarily, the 40% reduction in sunlight making its way inside the structure meant that the specially bred Bermuda grass used for the field died. This was despite originally believing that painting the windows might improve the growth of the grass since it had been formulated to grow indoors. Left with no grass, the stadium owners were forced to resort to a second paint job in which they painted the dirt floor green. The next year, they installed artificial grass instead. This was originally called chem grass, but following the successful use of it in the 1966 baseball season at the Astrodome, the manufacturer rebranded it. AstroTurf was born, an artificial grass that got its name from an indoor sports stadium, which had, in turn, got its name from the space programme. 